What's up, this is Sydney from Motors 14, and welcome back to another Skyrim video. Um, in this, uh, in the previous part, uh, this is my Dawnguard review, slash Let's Play. In the previous part, we basically did nothing. Uh, we went and got a quest from the guy at Fort Dawnguard, or a quest update from the guy at Fort Dawnguard, and he told us to go and... Uh, hunt down two people and recruit them, so that's what we're going to do. Right now, we're going to Falkreath, and we're going to find these people, and we're going to add them to the ranks of the Dawn Guard, so that we can, um, so that we can basically combat vampires more effectively. So, where are these people? Right there is one person. But, um, I have a sneaking suspicion that she's going to move. So, yeah, just travel to Carthwaston and hope we end up somewhere near. Wow, that guy really looks like a badass. Hmm. An armored troll. I don't think I want to go up against one of them bad boys. Uh, okay, so, where... Okay. Has she even moved? No, she hasn't. That's weird. So, I guess I'll, uh, ride my awesome armored horse. And just go find this person. I hope there's not too much in our way. Um, because we do have limited ammunition. Like, very limited am ammunition. We've only got uh, 73 steel bolts, and whoa, I just, what, like, what was that? I just appeared above the horse, so I'm gonna go into this cave, okay, a teleport, what in the world is this? Crossbow, steel bolts. I don't like the looks of this. And then just keep going down and down and down. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go this way here. And it's a dead end, it looks like. Yep. So, backtrack. And go up here. And where on earth do I go? Hmm. This is weird. The dungeons in this game are always tense. This is the exit. What? Okay. So, is this literally it? This can't be it. This is... That's it. That's literally the dungeon. That was worth nothing. Ah. Hmm. And it wasn't really even a dungeon at all. It was a mine. Ah. Come on. Okay, there's got to be a way around here. I may just have to go it on foot. So, I'm going to go up this mountainside. Can we go up the mountainside? Let's, come on. Go up the, go up the mountainside. Mm. And yeah, I think we can just platform like that, like that, uh, like that, like that, like that, like that, like that. Come on, like that, like that, like that. And yeah, uh, here we are. I think we're about to crest the hill here, and then, mm, looks like the way forward is over this, yeah, we can just walk straight up it anyway, it doesn't matter, and then, down here, yeah, like that, gotta be very careful here, though, and there's a goat, apparently, 
I'm gonna ignore him just this once. Just this once, goat. Feel lucky that I feel like ignoring you. Okay, so yeah, we're we're very close to a discovery here. I don't know whether this fort is going to be friendly or not. It seems like it's going to be friendly. Harmugstall. Hmm. Could this be the um, dwarven ruin she was talking about? Because it sounds kind of like one. Harmugstall. Hmm. Uh, okay, so are we going in the right direction? Yeah, we're very close, in fact. Harmugstall. Uh, sorry for that little uh, tapping, clicking sound. There's only three of you legionnaires versus one Stormcloak? Hardly seems fair. We'll see about that, won't we, boys? Time to end this little game. <laughs> oh, come on, Carjo, you friggin' party crasher. I was about to get that guy. And... No, that one of Carjo's arrows missed. Well, wow, this is really not doing that da that much damage against the soldiers. And I, on the other hand, am taking a lot of damage. And this guy's running, and he's dead anyway, so... No, you're not yielding. Yeah, if, if this is the actual Empire... What the fuck is that? Dragon... Whatever. Dragon Daedroth. Holy shit. Excuse the... Pardon my French. Maybe they... Maybe you won't like this river. Come on. Dislike this river. Yeah. Okay, you just get stuck on the rocks there. And keep in mind, can fuss or die your dumbass at any time. Although we're running... We're running real low on, um... On ammo. Well, at least we don't have as much ammo as I'd like to. So... I hope she... I hope she's essential. I hope that girl is essential, because she is getting it super hardcore from this dragon. Day draws right here! Okay, he's almost dead. Yes, Carjo killed him. Thank goodness. <sighs> Get five of my bolts back at least. Nope. I'm afraid I haven't. Hmm. Um. He's run. Wants me? Yeah. No, you must be mistaken. He made it exceedingly clear the last time we spoke that he had no interest in my help. Hmm. I find it hard to believe he's changed his mind. He said some very hurtful things to me before I left. Anyway, I'm quite happy in my current pursuits. So if you'll excuse me... Mm. Vampires? Really? Oh, and I suppose now he remembers that I proposed no less than three different scenarios that involved vampires overrunning the population. <laughs> well, what are they up to? They have an Elder Scroll. I... Well, that's actually something I never would have anticipated. 
interesting. I'm not sure what they would do with one, but in this case, this run is probably correct in thinking it isn't good. Yeah, no, really. If nothing else, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to learn more about what's going on so I can better defend myself. But I'm not just going to abandon what I've been working on here. It's too useful. I need at least one intact dwarven gyro. So either I need sure. to find the satchel those mud crabs stole, or I need another gyro from someplace. You wouldn't happen to have one, would you? No. Hmm. I'm sorry, but I'm not about to do that with at least a single gyro to show for my efforts. Hmm. I understand that, but I really can't leave here without at least one usable piece of dwarven equipment. A single gyro would be enough, I think. Believe me, this is useful stuff. Okay. Well, then I'm very sorry, but I can't just walk away from this project yet. Okay, so uh, I guess I'll go and crawl whatever that was. Oh, dwarven arrows! I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need those. I might not have. I. Come to think of it, I probably shouldn't have taken those arrows. They were arranged in a very particular fashion. So. But you know what? I'm going to crawl this area that sounds like it has a dwarven name. And I'm going to see if I can get a gyro. Well, I'm going to turn this fan on. It's getting, it's getting a little bit stuffy in here. Alright, there we go. A little bit better. And let's see. Harmugstall. Let us go within. Load! I hate loading screens. You know what? Come to think of it. No, that wouldn't be as interesting. I was, I was thinking about calling one of the uh, dwarven... Um, ruins that I've crawled already, but I'm not going to because, uh, and who are you? That was a close one. I don't know, but this place is full of them. Everyone I've encountered has been enchanted or the like. Look, I'm getting out of here. Normally spiders make my skin crawl, but magic spiders? <laughs> okay, go ahead. I guess I'll have to cure the play, uh, rid the place of freaking magic spiders. That doesn't sound good. Uh, okay, is that a couple of them right there? No, that's just some uh, greenery. Uh, what's that? What's that? Hmm, weird. Okay. Uh, looks like the lamp is sort of off-center there. That's weird. So, yeah. Dwarven. We're looking for a gyro. And I'll be honest, this place doesn't look particularly dwarven. Okay, so you had. How, how does this work? How do you. Okay, so we're apparently trying to get. We're apparently trying to flip those levers so that, um. Well, uh, so that we'll get all those freaking spikes out of the way. Hmm. Come on, there's got to be a solution. Hmm. This is really weird. 
Okay, so we've got those two down. And... Okay. So I guess we have to find the solution. Uh, all four of these are... Are, um... You know, I guess all four of these have to be down and then they'll basically tell those other ones over there to go down as well. That's why I'm guessing. I'm not sure. So let's try this combination. Um, okay, so we've uh, we've got one down or one up. Uh, try this combo. It's Hmm. This is a very hard puzzle. This is really difficult. What's this? Oh, thistle. Don't care about thistle. Um. Okay, so think here, GP. What do you have to do? That one forward, this one back. No. That one forward. No, back. Okay, so we're... Mm. Oh! I think I get it. So... This one controls uh, this one. The one to the right, that controls that one, so on and so forth. But uh, the thing is, other levers can also trigger other spikes to come up. So, no, that's not the right... Okay, so they're all four down. And there we go. Yep, that's exactly how I expect it to happen. Uh, so we've got stairs here, bones. And that's it. And I hear Frostbite Spider. Where are you, buddy? Where are you? I really need to know where you are. Hmm. A door? An expert locked wooden door, no less. Let's try to open it. Um, okay, so just gotta find the sweet spot here. Uh, like that. Ah! Ah, oh, lock, lock picking in this game is freaking hard sometimes. Come on! Seriously? Okay, th this has to be it. No! Ah. There we go, finally! And there's this frostbite spider. Yeah! Insta-kill! That was badass. So we've got a chest. It's extremely dark. And we've got uh, some gold and some orcish arrows. And wow. Like there's no light at all. You'd think there'd be light coming off of these candles, but... Uh, lavender, cast iron pot, potion of resist cold, snowberries, cast iron pot again, troll skull elves here, and no dwarven gyros. So let's plunge forward and see what happens. Uh, okay, so I'll just deal with this. Spidey. Right there. Yeah, really, you just picked up on that? And where are you? Oh, Black Widow. Those things are serious. 
They will make you a widower in a heartbeat. So, just want to check to see if these cages lead anywhere. I, okay. So that was that was a bit odd. Like I fired, and the game, and the game froze for a second. Okay, I have a suspicion that the crossbow just isn't acting at all like it's supposed to. Er, okay, I'm gonna try one more. Okay, that worked like it was supposed to that time. Uh, okay, and then can we go through here? No, we can't. And, yeah. So, this must be the way back? No, I was hoping this would be the way forward. Come on. Not one gyro. Not one gyro at all. That sucks. We need a frigging gyro. Can we get a gyro? Uh, open the wooden door. There's somebody who said, let's see if this works. I don't, uh, I don't think that guy's going to be nice to me. Where are you anyway? Okay, so finally Karjo put him down. And a frostbite spider. And wow, I'm low on health. I've really amateured that. Okay, so frostbite spiders, relatively harmless this time, weird enough. And I'm going to... Does he have a key? He must have. Yeah. Cornlouse, cornlouse, phrase key. Okay, so that must be that door there. Yep. And up here, I've got a chest. And a dead frostbite spider. Amethyst. Oh, this is a really good grab here. Spell tome lightning bolt. I think I've already got lightning bolts. So I'm not gonna um, use that. What is this? Shrine of Julianos. Still no gyro, but wow! Look at look at how long the video is. So yeah, you know, I'm gonna call it apart. Uh, so yeah, if you uh, if you want Dongar, if you like what you see, then please by all means go get on the Steam store. Um, link to it will be in the description below, and I'll see you guys in the next part. GP75.